Oh yeah! Caught something. What's up everybody, Derek here, and today I'm on an awesome section of the river. It's crystal clear water, it's got big boulders, so brought the kayak and I'm definitely going to be throwing a football jig around here. Um, supposedly this section has largemouth, smallmouth, and even some trout somewhere, but I, I, don't, I don't expect to catch one of those, but definitely the football jig. I've got a little Nico Hel Helgramite for a little finesse maybe up around some of these roots on these cypress trees. And then I've got a, a Bass Pro Shops like six or seven inch glide bait that has the S wave action. So I'm gonna go out here and see if we can't maybe catch a smallmouth or two because I have never fished this and it just looks awful fishy. So let's get to fishing. This looks like an awesome section to fish down through here, but I just got a 3 8 ounce football head jig with a just a twin tail grub on there. And we're gonna see if maybe some fish might be wanting this down through here in this little current section. Hoping there's some smallmouth kind of down through here. All right, here's our first set of rapids here. Gonna have to make it down these. And that wind is really kicking through right here, so we're gonna have to try to get down here below these falls right here and see if we can't maybe get out of the wind a little bit because the direction is blowing. And of course I'm standing right now, so I'm gonna have to take a seat here in just a second. Or not a seat, but a knee. There we go. Oh yeah! Nice! Oh, this is beautiful down here. I am definitely going to be trying to get over in this slack water and see if we can't maybe catch one or two. Oh, there was a hit right there. Something hit it. All right, here we go. Down some rapids. It's like straight down the middle. Looks safe to me. Oh, I better get down. No. A lot of good spots to maybe catch one. I just want one. I haven't caught a smallmouth in Texas in years. It has been years, probably since 2009. All right, I switched it up a little bit. I went with the Texas rig instead of that big old football jig. I'm thinking a little bit more action might be actually good in this water. So I got a 3 8 ounce bullet sinker. So we're Texas rigged and that cool thing about this one is when it sits on the bottom those those crawl pinchers really flare up so it gives it a lot more lifelike action and I think we might have a better shot at actually catching one with this one the wind completely flipped on me it's in my face now coming straight down at me so I'm gonna sit right here, 
fix, fish this Texas rig right down this this side right here. I want to fish this little section right here. It looks like there's some boulders that are kind of coming out right there. There's a shelf right there. It looks perfect for fish to be hiding in. something got some yes 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 oh my gosh finally man there just hasn't been much action oh that's a fat little smallie that thing's tiny but man that feels good to finally come after what I was coming for Thank you, bud. I just caught that smallie. I didn't have a lot of time to come out here. I spent a lot of time downstream trying to see if I could pull some out of a pool down there. Came back up to this pool and they were right there. And this is what they're eating. This is a crawfish pincher right here, but I think that's mainly what they're, they're eating in here. So they're probably about, oh, three to four inches long. But this may not be the greatest video because I only caught one fish in this video, but I have not caught a smallie in Texas in like since like 2009 or something like that and I caught that on the lake I wasn't even in the river in Texas smallmouth are like unicorns I mean you just never they're hardly anywhere I don't even think the state of Louisiana even has a smallmouth in it but I had a lot of fun I don't care I had a lot of fun I'm gonna have to have to come back out here and see if I can catch some more smallmouth I've got to regain, I'm originally from Arkansas, and i got to re regain that knowledge of my past of fish, fishing all those creeks and all the rivers up there because it's been a long time since I really went strictly after smallmouth, and I love those fish. They're great fighters for their size, but let me know what you guys think in the comments section, and thanks for watching, and subscribe if you haven't already. Like this video if you liked it, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Yeah.